Hanukkah begins this evening with modified celebrations due to the pandemic. News Channel 3's Taylor Bagley spoke to two local temples about what the holiday will look like this year. The Hanukkah menorah really is about hope. The doors have to stay shut this year, so Temple Isaiah in Palm Springs is taking its Hanukkah celebration outdoors Sunday afternoon. We have so much darkness right now. We wanted to do something that would just give people a little bit of hope. We're going to spin the dreidel. We're going to sing, dance, socially distance. Rabbi Steven Rosenberg says it was important to find a safe way for his congregation, including Temple President Mitchell Karp, to come together in person. If you're ambivalent about coming in person, you can come in your car and stay in your car in the parking lot and be in your own little bubble, which, which is great. So I want everybody to participate in a way that they feel comfortable. You know, one of our goals is, and one, one of our mandates in Judaism is to protect our lives and everyone else's life. And so we wanted to make sure that this was a safe thing to do. Temple Sinai in Palm Desert has gone completely virtual. With some good thinking and a little bit of organization, we've created a nightly congregational lighting of our Hanukkah menorah at 530 every night. And then this Sunday, we put together a special five o'clock Hanukkah sing-along for the congregation. The celebrations might look different this year, but the message of hope is as pertinent as ever. When you see light, when you see lights that are kindled, and you see a light burning bright, it's a sense that there's going to be a tomorrow. Taylor Begley, News Channel 3.